I'm breaking free. I am on a path that I just want to be a free spirit. I want to be able to wake up in the morning, give thanks for another day, feel good, feel positive, feel the light, feel all of the wonderful things that come with having another day. Another day that I can do something good with my life. Another day that I can impact someone else, even if it's in the smallest way, to help someone. To show that I care. To walk in truth and to walk in love. To respect other people. To embrace all that it is that makes me who I am. I have been on a spiritual journey learning more about myself than I thought that I ever could. And it's an interesting thing that the person that I would think knows should know more about me or the most about me should be me. But I find something to be very interesting. Other, the more that I know how other people see me, the more of a complete picture I get of myself. And I've learned on a spiritual journey that there's nothing wrong with saying I don't know. That there's nothing wrong with me saying I don't understand. That I love to learn. That I love to learn new things. That I love finding out about my history, my past, where I come from, embracing the culture, embracing the truth. These are some things that in a world where it seems that sometimes people live and, and love lies, that somebody like me can honestly just stand up and say, I just want the truth. I don't want to hear some fabricated story. I want the truth. Is that too much to ask? I ask myself, I sit there, I meditate, I think on all of the things that I'd like to know. And then I realize there are some things that are beyond my understanding. And there are some things that I truly do not need to know in order to exist. Why? How do I, how do I come to that conclusion? I wake up in the morning. When I wake up in the morning, did I wake up because of something that I did? Have you ever stopped and asked yourself why it is that you wake up and somebody else does not? Does it even matter why? So I take time and I actually give thanks for having another day. For being able to wake up and say, you know what? I might not know exactly why I'm here. I may not know exactly what it is that I'm supposed to do. But in the end, I feel as though I'm going to do whatever it is that I'm supposed to do, <laughs> regardless if I'm aware of it or not. And I found it to be very interesting and very uplifting to know that I've touched other people on a spiritual level on on a social level, on a level that helped them in some way just by being myself. That in itself is one of the most uplifting, positive things I've realized while being on my journey. I like to stay true to myself. I like to walk in truth. I like to walk in love. Whether that fits into some other particular type of spiritual belief, so be it. But I personally do not put myself in a box. I feel that I, I, I want to be free. I don't want to put myself in bondage, in a box, in some type of stereotype, in some type of in some type of category to be filed and ranked and numbered and placed on a shelf. That is just not how I see myself. 
on this path that I'm on, I've noticed that I can no longer turn a blind eye to things. Ignorance is not bliss. Because once your eyes are open, once you see the truth, it is not easy to turn your back on it. So in my life, in my journey, I have found that I'd like to be a better person. I like to be a positive person. And, and by doing that, I feel I have found my purpose in life. So I hope everybody's doing good, staying blessed and feeling well. And I'll see you guys next time. Let me know um, where you are, have you, how you guys are doing. And I hope everybody's doing good. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.